So we import oil, which no one seems to care about, even though we could all use natural gas, like Denmark, cleanest country in the world, to switch entirely to natural yeah. gas. But you have people like Sanders who just say, listen, we have to be extreme. We can't be any fossil fuel. And then we have a total fossil fuel situation in Congress. There's no middle ground. Again, Boone Pickens, smart guy, says, right. why don't we get a cleaner fuel until we can bridge to a non-fossil fuel? Well, let's, let's do natural gas. Yes. Let's and a cleaner clean fuel that we have, we meaning the United States. We're the large, we can be the largest exporter in the world. In three years, we will be the largest exporter of natural gas to other countries because we don't use it here. We have 200 years worth. I think it's all coming together, which is why tonight we're talking to one of the biggest boosters of natural gas out there, Boone Pickens. Remember, Pickens released an energy plan pushing natural gas right back in July of 2008. Man was ahead of himself. Ahead of everybody. That was two years ago. And now i got to ask, has the time finally come? Will Congress at long last start passing pro-natural gas legislation? The last time we heard from Pickens, he bet me 100 bucks that the Natural Gas Act would pass by Memorial Day. Deadline's passed, but hey, I'm not ready to collect because I want to lose this bet. And with that in mind, I'm thrilled to have him on the show. So let's find out what the future looks like for natural gas and for oil, for that matter. Mr. Pickens, it is an honor to have you back on Mad Money. Good. Thanks, Jim. Are hey, we about but, you know, we've got, the, we've got the legislation in place, and it is going to happen. <clears throat> Senator Reid, the majority leader, told me, he said, he had to have an energy bill this year, and that's going to happen. I do think I owe you $100 over it because I said we would have it passed by Memorial Day, and that didn't happen, but we did get it uh, filed before Memorial Day. So I'll, 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 go you, double I'll, you. I'll go double or nothing okay. to the end of 2010. Okay, 2010, all right, you got it. All right, terrific, terrific. Okay, I don't know whether you had a chance to hear the president the other day speak at Carnegie Mellon, but he directly said tapping our natural gas reserves. Am I parsing this too closely, or was that a big breakthrough? <clears throat> well, that's the second time he said it in 10 days, and that's good. He's starting to understand it's the only resource we have in America that will compete against diesel, and it's cleaner, it's cheaper, and it's ours. And so uh, it's, you know, we've got to use it. And, and uh, it's all going to happen. It's going to happen all for the right reasons. But I'm not totally natural gas. You know that. Right. right. What I am is American. I'll take any fuel in America. So when you said something about Navistar and, uh, and electric, great. Uh, I like the battery. I like, uh, I'm even a guy that will take ethanol. I'll take anything but OPEC oil. That's what I don't want. The trade deficit today, two-thirds of our trade deficit, is the purchase of oil. That does not need to happen, meaning that if we don't, if we, if we start using our own resources, my God, we, you know, now we're creating jobs, we're keeping money at home. The oil has cost us $1 billion a day right now. And if we don't do anything in 10 years, we will be paying three or $400 a barrel for the oil. Three to four hundred dollars a barrel. You think that could happen? I think, uh, absolutely think it. There's no question. If you go back and look at the period 2003 to 2008, OPEC's revenues were 250 billion dollars in 03. Five years later, in 08, they were one trillion two hundred and fifty billion dollars. Five times what they were in 03. Well, Boom Pickens, you are a delight to have on this show. You just keep the good fight. You've made us a lot of money here. The natural gas stocks have been great performers. You're absolutely right. All sorts of energy, as long as it's domestic, is the right thing to do. Great to see you, sir. Thank you for coming on Made of Money. Good. Thanks, Jim. Thanks absolutely. for having me. All right. Stay with Kramer. You know the story's just getting more and more exciting.